Alright, so in this video, um, it's going to be the opposite of calculating the H plus for each solution. We're going to be calculating the pH. So we're not giving the pH for the problem. We're going to have to find it. And so the formula uh, goes like this. Um, let's say we want, well, we have to always remember the formula of pH is equal to negative log H plus. So if we're given an H plus, all we have to do is just find the negative log of that H plus, and that'll be your pH. But let's say what happens if you're given an OH minus. Um, you are going to have to, there's a, a number which is constant, and you always use it for any problem. Um, something, and that number is 1. 1.0 times 10 to the negative 14. You use that for always when you're finding uh, negative, I mean, when you're finding um, the OH. Uh, I mean, well, we're given OH and then you convert that to H plus and you plug it into this equation and you get the pH. So uh, let's say we have, uh, let me erase this. So in our first problem, let's say we have uh, our OH. Our oh, yeah. goodness. Our OH is equal to 4.3 times 10 to the negative 5. So this, uh, we, uh, we divide the constant number 1.0 times 10 to the negative 14 by this. So 4.3 times 10 to the negative 5. And this always happens. So um, let's say we divide 1 divided by 4.3, then we divide these two. So 1 divided by 4.3 is, let me bring this closer, let it focus. Okay, 1 divided by 4.3 is 0.23. Let's just go with 0.23. So it's equal to 0.23 times 10 to the. So when we're dividing, we subtract. That means negative 14 minus negative 5. So that's negative 14 plus 5. That means it's negative 9. So it's 1.23 times 10 to the negative 9. And now this is our H plus. That's what the H plus is equal to. H plus is right there. And now we can plug it into this equation up here. So let me erase everything here. Okay. So 0.23 times 10 to the negative 9. We're going to find the negative log of this. And that's going to be your pH. Let's plug it in here. 0.23 times 10 to the negative 9. And we want to find the negative log for that. Give us 1, 2, 3 times 10 to the negative 9. And, and okay, find the negative log for this. And it's 9.63. So your answer should be 9.63 after plugging it in.